Hey everybody, this is Jeff Klopmeyer. We're at NAMM 2014 and we're up here in the ESP Guitars booth upstairs at NAMM in our same spot, same NAMM time, same NAMM channel. I want to talk to you guys about the E2 series from ESP. What is E2? It's brand new for 2014. A lot of people asking the same question. What does this mean? What is E2? Very simple. E2 is what formerly was known as ESP standard. So it represents really the standard of our ESP quality. These guitars are all made in Japan by ESP luthiers. And you can see by taking a look at the wall behind me here, we have some classic you know, ESP shapes, shapes like the horizon. But we brought back a few nice details this year. For example, the teardrop headstock, everyone seemed to love and enjoy this, and we brought it back for our horizon models. But we also came out with a whole bunch of new and exciting uh, shapes as well. I'm gonna point over here, these are the, the uh, ST2s. And there's some things on here that you normally haven't seen in recent years from an ESP model. The E2 ST2 has, as you can see, direct mount DiMarzio pickups. Uh, you know, we love all of our pickup manufacturers. We work with companies like EMG and certainly Seymour Duncan. But a guitar like this has some very, very nice details. You can see things like there's a flame maple top, great feel in maple fretboard over, over a maple neck, and an original Floyd Rose uh, bridge on this thing. You know, it's great. One of the nice things about ESP is that we have several levels of different types of guitars to meet several different types of customers. We have our LTD guitars for budget conscious musicians. We have lines like the E2 for pretty serious and professional musicians. And then for the highest end, we have two different lines, which we'll be taking a look at shortly. ESP USA and, of course, the ESP Original and ESP Custom Shop. I'd like to turn around this way if we can. If we could get the lovely Mary Lee out of the way. We also have some bold new shapes this year, like the FRX. You can see that there's a lot of you know, very nice you know, curves and, and very bold and extended horns on the guitar. And of course, components like original Floyd Rose and EMG active pickups. Um, these guitars are made with nothing but the finest level of components. I can actually show you some stuff here. Where the craftsmanship is beautiful, things like a set through neck where the heel is very, very smooth and very easy for playing up with the high registers. I like little details like this where your battery component compartment here flips open like the old ashtray that you used to see back when we could smoke on airplanes. Yes, kids, it's true. You could actually smoke on a tube in the sky. You can't do that anymore. Um, but the guitars themselves are very, very well made. There's a lot of attention to detail. You'll notice in the workmanship and the frets. This particular one is a 24 fret model. And of course, beautiful, beautiful finishes. This particular finish is called Reindeer Blue. If anyone out there sees a blue reindeer, you're on drugs. So E2 represents really what ESP standard used to be. It still meets the price point that's affordable enough for most serious and professional musicians, um, but still has all the quality that we always had from the best of our, our ESP standard guitars.